food is the ingredient that brings us together. Hello everyone, today we're going to be taking you to uh, Pokidoki on uh, Broadway close to the intersection of uh, Heather. Uh, so stay tuned as we go inside the restaurant and check out the beautiful dishes that they serve. Inside the gift card promotion they also have a couple more for instance if you write a google review you get a free drink and if you follow them on facebook and check in you actually get a free protein at the restaurant they have a condiment station that has lemon and mint uh, infused water as well as other condiments the cool thing is they also have uh, sauces that are uh, gluten free or vegan so uh, you can ask them and they can uh, basically adjust any of your uh, uh, sauces to make sure that it uh, adheres to your dietary needs inside the restaurant is really beautiful they have that white concept lots of uh, light uh, and they have uh, quite a bit of uh, space uh, for customers um, overall they have done a really uh, great job with the decoration and the restaurant is uh, very beautiful The chef is going to show us some of the items from their catering uh, menu. Um, so everything on their menu uh, can be prepared uh, for special events uh, or for uh, catering. Um, so if you do have uh, any special events or parties coming up, don't forget to uh, reach out to them because they have some delicious uh, salads as well as their menu items are uh, really, really uh, flavorful, which we're going to show you in uh, just a couple minutes. So stay tuned. So this is some of the toppings that you have the choice of getting. Here we got um, some uh, scallops, uh, some seaweed, and also uh, octopus. So we'll give it a try and see how uh, these are. Just kind of on a sauce with some uh, fish eggs. It's really good. Really creamy, juicy. You have that shellfish flavor a little bit but again it's not overpowering giving that all the sauces from the ingredients that go in there so you got the sweetness of the sweet corn you got the crunchiness of the green peas and then you got the, the scallops there and then as well as the creaminess of the, the mayo that they have here's the seaweed mm, that's really good it's sweet it also I think has some sesame probably some sesame oil so you get that richness from sesame 
some sweetness and also that uh, seaweed itself is like crunchy but it's really really delicious and here last but not least is one of your uh, protein choices or their protein choices is uh, octopus this is really flavorful too so they have some dressing on it it's a little bit crunchy but it's it's um, with the dressings and, and all the toppings that they have put in there it's really flavorful which I'm gonna go over in just a couple of minutes. Overall, I love their dressing. I was actually asking the chef whether they sold it in store, and unfortunately at the moment uh, they don't, but these uh, dressings are basically on another level, really flavorful, really delicious, uh, and I can't wait for them to sell them in the store so I can stock up on a couple of uh, uh, bottles of these. So this is their uh, veggie platter with uh, chipotle sauce uh, that they do for uh, basically for events or catering which is uh, great so if you uh, need any, any caterer you can reach out to them so let's try the chipotle sauce it's a little bit spicy sweet really flavorful creamy really nice this is their other sauce, their house-made um, soy-based sauce with soy sauce, mayo, as well as other uh, spices that they use. It has that smoky flavor from the soy sauce, the creamy, the taste of the, the mayo. It's really nice, really flavorful. The onion, ginger. Uh, sauce which also have uh, olive oil let's take a look at this it's really really creamy you can see the olive oil this one's more refreshing so you get that um, oiliness from uh, the oil of oil a little bit of the taste of onion and a hint of ginger so it's really clean um, kind of like a vinaigrette not not that creamy because it's just olive oil as well as onion and ginger and just some spices. This one is the uh, creamy wasabi so it's mayo wasabi it kind of gives you like a feeling of that you're eating um, California roll because it has that mayo creaminess as well as a little bit of wasabi but the wasabi is not uh, overpowering the flavors at all it's not spicy it's just the, the the taste of it that you feel it's really good i've loved all of their uh, dressings we got one more this is their uh, creamy citrus so this is also mayo based as well as some uh, citrus in there let's take a look Same thing here, it's creamy, a little bit of that hint of that um, sourness or a little bit of the citrus that you get, but it's not too much. It's really flavorful, and uh, with these dressings, I'll definitely be eating my veggies, that's for sure. Uh, well, but basically, this is how they would uh, put it together for a catering or a special event. When you come in here, you get the choice of having it in a bowl, but today for us, they put it in these beautiful glasses. We're gonna give it a try. The chef was mentioning these are kind of more of a Hawaiian style, which is just the, the fish is tossed together with some veggies. Uh, we got chickpeas, as well as some uh, sweet corn, cucumber, and uh, shreds of uh, seaweed. So let's give this a try. I think we got a little bit of salmon and tuna. 
with some fresh veggies. The fish is really fresh and soft, just melts in your mouth. It's really refreshing. Let's have another bite. You get that hint of uh, wasabi there. Really nice, and then you get to have a little bit of veggies as well. So there's chickpeas, cucumber, and also uh, corn. They're really beautiful, really colorful. basically what the poke bowls uh, come, this is how they come. Um, so today they have displayed it uh, for us and put it in a beautiful plate. We got fresh cucumbers uh, in the bottom, brown rice, uh, avocados, uh, some sweet corn, as well as uh, green beans and also the, the fish. So it's beautifully displayed, we got some sauce on the side. It looks extremely delicious and I don't even feel like breaking it to try it. It's, it's just appetizing looking at it. But we have to try and see how they taste. See the things I, I have to do for you guys. They have that citrus sauce uh, dressing on it. It's a little bit of citrusy, lemony taste. Um, the fish is just melts in your mouth. Uh, just as soon as you put it in your mouth, it, it breaks apart. It's really refreshing. You can you can taste that the fish is really fresh itself, and that um, citrus mayo or citrus dressing that they have also add to it. So let's try the sauce here too. Really good, really really good. Extremely delicious and healthy because it's just fish and um, salad basically and veggies. Their uh, hot poke, which they're coming up with uh, soon, so it's basically um, garlic uh, prawn with uh, sautéed veggies and your choice of uh, rice. So here we have uh, brown rice, and it smells extremely delicious. We have the smell of ginger and garlic and sautéed veggies. Really, really. Flavorful, you can smell all those ingredients. Can't wait to try it. Concept, which is a hot poke uh, bowl, which um, they have uh, here uh, so pan fried uh, prawns with uh, garlic and ginger as well as some uh, sauteed uh, veggies so this will be great for uh, the fall as well as winter time uh, that you can enjoy uh, some hot uh, okay so let's give it a try and, and see how it is so we're going to try just the veggies we got uh, cabbage as well as uh, carrot onion uh, bell peppers let's get some more of them and it's uh, lots of onion and ginger. Mm. It's really flavorful. You get the taste of the garlic as well as a little bit of the onion and ginger. Let's give that rice a try. And last but not least, we'll, we'll try the prawns. Brown rice. Here is the pan fried garlic ones. The 
prawns are cooked really well. It has a little bit of a lemony taste to it, but they're extremely soft. So you, you can you can tell that they're cooked to perfection. Because with prawns, if they're overcooked, they become uh, really uh, rubbery. But with these, it just basically melts in your mouth. It doesn't show any resistance. Overall, we had a great experience. The staff were really nice. The chef was amazing. Um, he served us each of the dishes and uh, he was um, telling us what went in the dish, how it was uh, prepared. So you can tell he was really passionate about what he's doing and it actually shows in his food because the food was extremely delicious. Uh, and uh, I can't wait for them to start selling those uh, dressings and sauces so I can actually buy a couple of uh, bottles because they're extremely delicious. As well, the, the shrimp was cooked really well, it was really soft. Uh, and overall we we loved it um, so uh, I highly recommend you guys check them out too and uh, try uh, their food for your, uh, yourself and make the decision if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and we would love to hear your uh, comments so make sure to leave that in the comment section uh, below and don't forget to subscribe